Hello Pisces, my name is Isabel from the tarotempress.com. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. Today I'm going to be doing your tarot card reading, so let's begin. So love is something that is definitely on your mind during this period of time. I feel like it is featuring very heavily during this month specifically. Now when it comes to the person you are dealing with, their feelings is reflecting the fact that they want to either get to know you very slowly or to take their time in their interactions and engagements with you. This particular tarot card is telling me that this individual sees a future with you, but they don't want to rush into things. At the same time, this is not something to feel disheartened about. Because usually with this tarot card, when someone has it in their placement, it means when they start things, they have a natural affinity to complete it. So it means that they have staying power and that they are not someone that just is in and out of a relationship and is gone with the wind. So they do have a good and sincere intention towards you. Now, what are their desires, what are they hoping to achieve in this situation? The tarot cards are showing me that this person wants to build a life with you. So if the two of you are in love or falling in love, they want to see where the road will lead them. I feel like they do feel that you are a part of their destiny. They have a lot of positive feelings attached to you. I feel like when they are around you, it's almost like they will start spinning and they feel like life is going to be better. So they have a very positive view of you. They do see the potential of a relationship if the two of you are not already in a relationship. And I feel like this person does have a lot of willpower to stay in this relationship or get into a relationship with you. So they have very positive feelings and desires when it comes to having a relationship with you. When it comes to your feelings in this particular situation, I do get a sense that if the two of you have encountered any challenges or difficulties during this period of time, you are definitely looking for a way to come out of conflict, to navigate yourself into a position of where you have happiness and joy. I do feel like you want this person to reach out to you or you want to take care of this person in a way that you are romantically involved with them. So I feel like you do want to do some grand gestures or perhaps you want them to do some grand gestures towards you, depending on whether you're male or female female, even though that is not, uh, you know, gender based. So let's move on. You are hoping to have a situation in which this person makes up their mind on something. I feel like someone could be in a position which they have a choice to make or they have a challenge in front of them that they could be in denial about. So they could be at crossroads over some factor that is happening in their life and they are unable to decide on what they want during this period of time. Now, let's look at the obstacles they are facing. Again, I feel like the person you're dealing with is struggling to make up their mind on what they want. 
I feel like this person has two variables in front of them and they don't know which one is better for them. So you could be involved with someone or you could be in the process of getting involved with someone that has another person in their life or perhaps they are in a situation in which they are unable to decide what they want in their life. So I do feel like this person struggles to take actions. They take a lot of time to think about things but they can't really back it up with some sort of valid steps. So I feel like there's this disconnect in terms of their words and their actions. This could be due to the fact that they live inside of their mind a lot and they think about the possibilities, even though they have the desire to lay those seeds in the ground and have them sprout into this beautiful relationship. I feel like they are still in the beginning stages of that. They haven't yet initiated what they are looking for in this relationship. Even though stability is one of the things that are on their mind. So let's see. Yeah, so if the two of you have broken up, I do feel like this particular tarot card is indicating a desire on their part to have harmony in this relationship between you guys. I feel like they have positive intentions towards either getting back together with you or reflecting upon the situation in which they figure out what they want in this situation. There's a lot of interesting tarot cards here. I'm going to clarify the tarot cards on the top level first. This person sees a future with you, that's quite clear. They feel that if they start something with you, they know that it has the power to materialize into something that is going to be absolutely amazing. They do have a lot of love towards you, that's definite. If the two of you have been having any sort of arguments or fights. The tarot cards are reflecting that it is very childish in nature and it is not something that should be, you know, um, presented as a challenge to cause cracks in your relationship. The two of you should overcome it. So in terms of what they are hoping to achieve in the situation, if they have hurt you, they want forgiveness. That's what the tarot cards are saying. If they have done anything to make you feel bad or if they have treated you unfairly or taken you for granted, they don't want that to be the core energy between the two of you. They want to clear up that sort of misconceptions, misunderstandings and difficulties that were experienced during that period of time. I feel like you may be feeling heartbroken over their actions, their words, their deeds, what they have done towards you. You may be carrying that pain inside of you and they want you to forgive them. That's what it's showing in these tarot cards. Now, when it comes to your desires or what you're hoping to achieve in the situation, I do feel like this person generally feels bad. So I feel like you want them to break free of whatever limitations or restrictions they are in. They could be involved, you know, in some cases with an individual that is not good for them, or they could have bad influences surrounding their life that is affecting them on a negative level. I feel like the obstacles for them right now is figuring out what they want. They need to make a decision, but they're taking their time to do so. I feel like they're thinking about it inside of their mind and they don't know what they want. So we're going to be exploring the solutions as well as the steps they need to take, the steps you need to take, the obstacles and what other challenges there are in terms of the relationship, the possibilities of reconciliation on the extended tarot card reading. You can also find it on the Elite Tarot Society. Check the links in the description box below. And if you want a personal tarot card reading, you can get it at the tarotempress.com. Have a wonderful day and enjoy your week ahead. Take care.